Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Digimon World 2. In the last part, we showed Professor Pio the Digimon he wanted to see, and he said, fuck you, I don't want them, go see Ben Oldman. And then we found out our Digimon were sick, and now we are stealing the DNA of the Digimon so we can cure the sickness. Well, we aren't really stealing the DNA from them. We're asking politely, and they're giving it to us. But we need to bribe them into giving us their DNA so that we can then frame them later for uh, crimes. So I need to get a Digivice for Clockmon. Digivice for Clockmon. Yes. Do 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 Digivice. All right, so we got a Digivice, transfer it over. Now let's go bribe Clockmon. Clockmon! And then after this, we'll find out the whereabouts of Ben Oldman. Maybe. I mean, I don't know. I've never played this game before, right? I've not played this game ever before. This is brand new. It must be brand new graphics. Look at these graphics. Clockmon, I got you a Digivice. Wow, you brought me a Digivice. All right, I'll give you this data patch as promised. Go save the sick Digimon. Thank you, Clockmon. Now I got the data patch. So now I just need the virus patch. Anjumon, I need a virus type Digimon. Unless I get digital DNA from a virus type Digimon, I can't save the Digimon in the city. Hmm, that's a problem. There was an Ogremon here, but he went somewhere. Seems like that Ogremon left with a tamer. That's all I know. Oh no, who took Ogremon? Who did Ogremon partner up with? I think they knew each other from before. That doesn't help me! Do you know where Ogremon? Do you, you want to know who became Ogremon's partner? It was the kid who used to come here all the time. They became real friendly. She was a really energetic kid. Ogremon really liked her. All right, so obviously we know who that is. That would be Kim. And let's go talk to Kim. Ah, uh, let's go talk to Kim. And she hopefully has Ogremon by her side. So Kim was of course right inside here. Kim! Hey Kim, I have a question I want to ask you. At Meditation Dome, did you get a virus type Digimon as a partner? A virus type bitch Digimon? You mean Ogremon? Yeah, I got Ogremon for a partner. What about it? Great, so it was you, because there was this weird sickness going around the city, the Digimon of the city. I need the digital DNA patch from Strong Will Digimon of all three types. But even at De Meditation Dome, I couldn't get a digital DNA of a virus type Digimon. Oh really? If that's all you need, we have a lot of that. Okay then, I'll access your DigiBeetle browser. There you go, it's all transferred. Thank you, Kim. Now I can go ask Professor Pio to create the, create the wild code. And I got a virus patch. Oh god, my reading skills are not getting better. For some reason, they're getting worse. Professor Pio, I got patches for all three Digimon types. Mike, well done. I'll create the wild code right away. First, I'll access your DigiBeetle browser. Take the digital DNA in those patches. Whoa, beautiful DNA. Then, and do this, that, that, there, and done. Thank you, for pre Professor. I can go back to the guard team now. So we just solved a major sickness in about 20 minutes total time. I'd say that's pretty good. I wish real science worked that quick. If real science worked that quick, we'd be able to have computers that could hold an infinite amount of data. And I would be recording this in 150,000p without lagging because my card would be able to play that. 
Ah, well, if only. I must see the Black Lord leader. Please let me through. Hmm, maybe. Wait here. Black Sword leader will see you now. So, yeah, if you tried to go over the, in there before, he would get rejected because of the uh, virus or the sickness. Guess you can't, I guess they can't call it a virus because a virus type. Black Sword leader, I found out the cause of the sickness. What happens is that the Digimon's DNA begins to mutate and change suddenly. But the wild code created by Professor P.O. should solve the problem. Great! Well done, Mike! Now you can protect Digimon in the city. We're all grateful. But I wonder why their Digimon DNA began to change. This is strange. Uh-oh. Sir, the Blood Knights have been spotted again! Well, that was... <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. Sir, Blood Knights have been spotted! Bye! Bye! Run away! They begun their move, just as I expected, Mike. Yes, sir! Their dark plot will probably become clear soon. You must find the Archive Ship as soon as possible and uncover their plot! Yes, sir! You can count on me! Ugh, everything's happening at once. My mind is spinning. And now we don't have auto checks, so that's good. Uh, I still don't think that we have anything new here real quick. I just want to check it real quick. Oh, Magna Anjumon for Garurumon. So that is an ultimate level Digimon. Garurumon, though. So we gotta have a Garurumon. Not a guru Ruban. Hmm. Keep that in mind. Keep that in mind for sure. So, Tamer's Club. Let's see what's crack-a-lacking over here. Esmeralda. I want to know about a man named Ben. Ben Oldman? I've heard that name before. Ah, yes, he was the Blue Falcon leader a long time ago, right? That's him. I need to see where... I need to see him, but I can't find him. Where Ben lives? Hmm, I don't know. But... Oh, Joy Joy mentioned that she saw him somewhere. Try talking to her. Maybe she knows where Ben Oldman lives. Alright, so we'll go talk to Joy Joy. This guy's still infatuated with Palmon. So you can't get any information out of him. So basically, you already know who to talk to. So we got to go talk to Joy Joy. Joy Joy, happy happy Joy Joy, happy happy Joy Joy, happy Joy Joy. You're not here anymore. What's going on? Sheena, where's Joy Joy? Where's Joy Joy? I'm pretty sure she has to be in device though, right? She's not. Yeah, they're not allowed in here. So let's go check device dome real quick. And I definitely mean device dome. I'm pretty sure she's not at the meditation dome. I always thought it was weird. Her uh, thing for saying your Digi Beetle is ready changes there for no real reason. Oh no, more Blood Knights. But, let's go talk to Joy Joy. Hopefully. Or at least find out where Joy Joy would be. What's up? There are a lot of strange people in Device Dome. Including you, Mr. Strange Man. Anybody in here? Technodonna, what's up? Hey Mike, did you come to see me? What? Kim's not around. She's gone somewhere. You're just looking for her? That's all. Go away. I'm not make, gonna make you anything. Oh, do I sense some jealousy? A little bit of jealousy, maybe? Well, Joy Joy doesn't seem to be anywhere around. I wonder if there may be 
in the dungeons. Hmm. Aren't there some new kinds of Digimon somewhere? Once in a while, you can create a rare Digimon by DNA Digivolving. What new Digimon will appear depends on the number of DNA Digivolutions up to that point. So that's basically the only time in the game that they mention DP, which they don't even mention DP, they just kind of hint that your Digivolutions make new Digimon later, and of course they don't actually re reference it by name. Check Meditation Dome just in case. I don't want to be a fool and go to a dungeon when Joy Joy's not there, but I'm pretty sure Joy Joy is in one of these dungeons. Uh oh. Who's. Who. Stop. Stop running away from me. They say the Blood Knights are looking for the Archive ship. What do they want with a legendary ship like that? What's up, Anjumon? The Blood Knights are looking for the Archive ship? It is a huge ship that many humans and Digimon used to escape from File Island. Legend says it was a huge turtle-like Digimon with a super strong will. Ah, I see. Turtle-like Digimon. Well, guess we have no choice but to look into the device. These two domains. So we got these two and BIOS. BIOS is obviously the last one to do because it was the last one we did before. So let's go web or drive. Web or drive. Let's do web. Alright, we're starting off with some Woodmon and of course that good old fashioned Raremon, Numamon thing. Ah, feels like it was a long time that we have been in, not been in a dungeon. Ah, sweet, an easy Numamon fight. Since you guys haven't had any battle in the last few episodes, other than, I guess, the last episode where I killed a fucking Bergermon, but, you know. These guys are getting close to leveling up anyway, so. Uh, Devimon is at 20. And once he gets 21, we can digivolve him into an ultimate Digimon. A uh, poor, confused Numamon. Having an action. Oh yeah, I checked uh, in between this episode and the last episode for that page where the guy had given me all the names of, well not all of them, but most of the names of the Digimon World 2 moves in, Jap in Japanese. And unfortunately his page is no longer up. So I'm not able to take a look at that page very much. And that music just went off again? What? Hopefully that's, yeah, that probably kicked off. That's weird. Well. Sorry if the music does, you know, disappear for that. Happens every time I lose focus on the emulator. Unfortunately. Alright, so these guys are pretty easy. We've done this many times before. The only reason I'm not cutting it out is because, I'm, I don't know, just felt like killing these guys on camera. Sindarlon, you're one-eyed motherfucker. More like Sint- he's like a Sintar- uh, Sintwar and a Cyclops. Sintar- Sintwar Cyclops. Crimson Day. Oh boy, those guys are poisoned. Um... Guard. Guard. Just go ahead and fin finish him with Leomon, just in case we do get at least, I don't know how far we'd get through this dungeon, but assuming we get through it all the way, we might as well uh, save up some MP for later. Win! Yatta! Ah, th three. Yeah, I don't know what I was about to say, but I meant to say 
not no. that. Please don't. What was that? Energy. Okay. Not too bad. I was going to say only a thousand HP for Devamon to get to level 21. Yep. Well, this is a very easy floor, and at the same time, impossible if we did not have that magnetic missile. Always, at this point, always need magnetic missiles. I probably don't have enough to finish this dungeon. I'll probably get another magnetic missile floor later and be fucked. So usually you should probably carry two. Eh, come on, go away, energy bug. Not only is it because you're annoying the sound, it's also because energy is precious now. These floors are starting to get longer, and I want to have as many, or I want to have as much energy as possible. I could probably go about upgrading my Digi Beetle. I mean, I have enough bits now. I'm not in any need for extra bits at the moment. Uh, what are we at? 15k? Yeah, 16k. 16k bits. That is a lot of bits for now. Alright. Oh, we're already on the floor with Koagamon. So that shows you the spike in difficulty between these domains. We're on the third floor and we're running into Koagamons that we were running into on what, the seventh floor on the other domains? And my ear itches! Itchy ear! Okay, ah, much better. Trying to avoid, of course, the... I'm trying to avoid some most of the battles, really. Because I don't need all, all of the battles, especially if I want to get Devamon out of here without going for too far over 21. Huh. Well, we're gonna have to fight Quagamon. Let's go fight that Quagamon. Am I gonna keep it in? Yeah, I'm gonna keep it in. Might be the last thing we do in this episode, but I'm gonna keep it in. Show these guys who's boss. Uh, let's see. Confuse Gardramon. Actually, no. Confuse Kawagamon. I just might as well just take him out in general. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and focus on Kawagamon. If we kill him in two hits, then I'll remember that for later. Haha, <laughs> you're confused, bitch. Have an index. That's, that's very odd that they would change Destruction Grenade to Protect Grenade. It makes, makes no sense. Like, Protect Grenade makes no sense. Not the fact that they would change it. Censorship. It makes sense in only the eyes of the censor. Alright, so don't have to worry about Kwagamon anymore. So let's focus on Gardramon now. Everybody, on to the robot guy. The robot, I always thought that he kind of looked like a safe, like he's a robot safe thingy. What are you, what are you guarding? Are you guarding money? Are you guarding secrets? Something is inside there and I need to know. Also, why are your grenades actually missiles? They're not grenades at all. And pow, right in the kissa. All right, he's dead. Aw, oh, and he's confused, not confused anymore. So, his, the name for his move made a lot of sense, and now that I don't have that to show you anymore. I don't remember what it was, sadly. But it made a lot more sense. Once I heard it, I was like... Or, once I read what it was, I was like, Oh! That's what he was saying!
like the one of the biggest oh moments was Tapirmon or Tapirmon. His uh, move when I always thought is it's like Aikamenasoda or it sounded like that Aikamenasoda or something like that. I don't know exactly how it sounds, but he's actually saying Nightmare Syndrome. So it's like Nightmare Syndrome. And I'm like, oh my god, mind blown! Mind blown of what he actually says. I really wish that list still worked, or I wish I would have saved that list before the guy took it down, or whatever happened. I might be able to still find it on, uh... Might be able to still find it online somewhere if I looked I might look into that because it'd be very interesting to see what all the moves were called in J Japanese if there are still things out there so no level up um, I'm gonna say fuck it and we're gonna go take this episode to 25 minutes oh yeah push it to 25 oh no Stay- Ah, oh, fucking Gekko on. And we're back, and since I pushed it to 25, I decided that battle is too much. And Leomon leveled up, so that was good. Uh, what's his face? Centaurmon is getting close. Uh, right, you again, huh? Well. Alright, once again, you are an annoying um, encounter, so I- ah! Alright, this one... Might as well leave in. This will probably be the last battle of the freaking thing. Ah, it's a new battle. Okay, definitely keeping you in. So, basically, it's the, still the same thing, I think. Quagamon is the dangerous one. Most dangerous, I at least. Pisukamon, I think, has that poisoning assist thing so he's kind of dangerous if he like gives everybody poison but since we're uh, I'm not sure about Flymon brown stinger all right pretty weak confuse Quagamon yeah good confusion now for the rest of them to do their work. Yep, he does have it. Panic wave. Oh, yeah, I mean it was the confusion thing that he gives. Well, now I suddenly wish that Pisukamon was the first one that I took out. Motherfucker. Let's get rid of him before he gives a... Uh, everybody else confusion ah fuck he's gonna confuse somebody so I can definitely hear what he is saying he was saying deadly sting deadly sting luckily Leomon has a counter that we don't exactly use yet. Oh, why'd you have to get hit? So yeah, uh, if in hindsight, take out P. Sukumon first to get rid of Panic Wave, and it's still not gone yet. Shit. Uh, that some pump is actually scissor arm. That's what I definitely remember that being. And unfortunately, I don't think counterattacks will save us from using a random move. So let's just hope he gets unconfused. Uh, definitely just focus on you killing him and let's go finish off Guagmon. So this is actually a pretty dangerous encounter right now. Thank God.
All right, so Kasukamon is gone. Centaurmon is going to whiff now. Flymon, please don't confuse Centaurmon. Ah, confusing Devimon's pretty much just as bad. Miss, miss. And Leomon. Have a Naku. Heavenly action, maybe? I don't know. Ah. This sucks. Would have been so much smoother if I would have just remembered and took it out Pisukamon first. So we're pushing this episode up into 27 minutes, motherfucker! Think at least it lost confusion power. Uh, but he still has that poison. So all around, this is a fucking... This is bad all around. All sorts of status effects getting thrown around in this encounter. This should be the end of Quagumon, though. Alright, now it's just Flymon. And hopefully that guard works. Um, Centaurumon is leveling up after this fight. So he can use as much of the MP as he wants. Shit. Ah, that's a bad one. Why couldn't it have been Demidart again? Devamon kind of going to be aching in this fight. Oh shit, he still gets to attack? Adding insult to injury. Flymon's probably done the most damage out of this fight just because he's freaking consistent and fast. Alright, we're finally done with that encounter. No, what? Oh my god, he is a tank. Alright, now you better fucking die. Alright. How much experience did we get for that? 200. Not really worth it. And he didn't level up. That's not great. So, in the next part, we're going to... Uh, maybe go farther? Well, actually, yeah. We're going to go farther right now. Uh, we're just making this episode as long as fucking possible, aren't I? So in the next part, we're going to not fight that, and we're going to see what else is in this domain. So until next time, guys, I'll see you later. I need to figure out a better way to end the episodes than that.